All right, guys, we're back. It's Chris Stem, IPB Pro, with shooting another video. Today, we're gonna talk about every one of us has a last fight in us. We always have a last fight in us, but we gotta dig down. Sometimes you have to dig down deeper than you, you're supposed to dig. Just like my situation, coming out with a spinal cord injury, walking and, and lifting and doing everything else, and then you go into surgery, you come out and you have a spinal cord injury. So a lot of time, most people quit. But I know every single one of you guys, just like myself, every one of us has a last fight in us. And that last fight's gonna push us through. And sometime when we think, that was my last fight, no, there's always a more, one more last fight that you have in you. Every single time there's a last fight you gotta push through because every single one of us has a champion in us. The only difference is we have to dig down, sometimes so deep, and sometimes we're going through that darkness just to get to the light. But just remember, every single time when it gets dark, there's always light. That light will shine sooner or later, but just know you gotta fight through. You gotta push through. We all have a last fight in us, and if we're not willing to push through, it's not the last fight, I promise you. Every time you think you're gonna quit, it's not the last fight. There's one more fight in us every single time. What's the difference between a horse race? A horse win by the, a nose, just a nose. The only difference is they win five, 10 times the prize money. The reason why is because it's that little nose, that little edge that you gotta push through to push that last fight that's gonna take you to victory. And if you're not willing to push that last fight, you know what, that's when the enemy's gonna get you. It knows, it knows, but just remember, the enemy does not know what to do if you just don't quit. But you gotta know you have that last fight in you. And a lot of time is you gotta dig down so deep. But just remember, he always puts things on your plate that he knows you can take care of. The only difference is you have to believe it in yourself that you got that last fight that you can push through every single time. Just know every single time you're going through that tunnel, there's a light underneath the tunnel. Sometimes you might have to keep going and keep going and keep going. Have faith, have belief, have trust, and just keep moving because you know that last fight is in you, but you just need to not quit. You gotta keep pushing through every single time. So push through that last fight. Every single one has a champion in this. Just keep going, keep going, keep going. Because you, when you don't quit, like I said, there's nothing that the enemy could do to you. You're going to win every single time. So don't quit. Keep going. Now I'm going to talk a little bit about health tips. I see a lot of people, they eat their meals, but then all, 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 every single time they just count calories. They're counting calories to say, you know what, I'm on a thousand, uh, thousand calorie a day. I'm on a 1500 calorie a day. The only difference in all the calories they're taking in is carbs, fat, grease, lard, everything else that your body shouldn't be taking in. Count your calorie, but count your calorie from your protein is the first thing. The reason why is because your body needs protein. Your hair, your nails, your muscle, your metabolism, everything is based on protein. Count your protein as calorie first, then count your good fat next. Good fat means almonds, avocados, peanuts, stuff that your body is gonna utilize and it's gonna absorb a lot better. Not only that, your mind is gonna work straight and everything else. If you cut your fat, you cut your carbs, next thing you know, you're gonna be in big trouble. Especially ladies, you're gonna be pretty moody if you cut that fat, so you wanna keep that fat in you every single time. But just remember, count your protein first, count your good fat first, okay? If you don't know what good fat is, your omega-3, 6, and 9, look it up. I'm not gonna get into it in this video, but count those two first, and then count your carbs. And the carbs, calorie in, calorie out. The more you burn, the more you use. If you don't burn, don't use it. Make sure the fat and the protein is consistent first. Other than that, I love you, God bless. I will walk, basically squat, and leg press all over again. Walk, squat, leg press all over again. I keep saying that in my head over and over again because that's what you got to do for yourself. Whatever your affirmation is, say it over and over and over and over again, and guess what? It will happen sooner or later. God bless. I love you, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.